guys, I'm back with my next creations and welcome to another Sam Sam review with you, with you. And as you can see, all my new ones are all at the top, pretty much. So they won't be too hard to get out. So they'll be linked in the description box below to the last episode and the playlist for it, basically. Anyway, let's get started. Right guys, these are my new Simpsons right here. Whoop. Anyway guys, just before we get started, may I just tell you guys, this video may be a bit longer because I am actually reviewing, as well as all my Simpsons, well my new is Simpsons, I'm also going to be reviewing my newest Funko Pop, which is Joy, from Inside Out. And also I will be reviewing some new Shopkins, which I've got recently, so yeah. So it's like a bit similar to last episode with a lot of bits and bobs, but mostly some sums, of course. Anyway, we've got quite a few since last time, well, last video. As you guys can probably tell, I have got four on the bottom, three in the middle, two above them ones, and one on the top. So I've actually got a pyramid of more than six of just my new ones. Yeah, okay. So I've literally got these this week, just so you guys know. And yeah. So I'll start reviewing them in one second. Oh yeah, another thing I've got to tell you guys, I'll also be reviewing, well, a short review of my Aaron Anna, well, no, Elsa, and also my Anna Frozen Fever dolls. Well, yeah, so I'll try and make this video as short as possible, but like I said, I've got all this other stuff as well. Anyway, so let's start on the Sum Sums half of the review, what well, part of the review. In the description box below, I'll put in different parts for what I'm reviewing. But these guys are first. So let's start with the one on the top, which is Daisy Duck. Let's go. Right, so this is Daisy. And she has, like, um, her dress is, like, she has purple. Because they kind of want her bun to kind of stick out from under the dress. But other than that, she probably would look a bit more like a mini. But they kind of made it look more like a shirt. But I, it doesn't matter. Everybody knows it's a purple dress. Um, and she's got little white feathers for her front part and she's got her little webbed yellow feet on the back and she's got this adorable cute face with little blush cheeks and an awesome a tiny little beak now she has like the same eyes as Minnie while the other team says hello them they all seem to have similar eyes to some sums but yeah she's got basically mini eyes and she's also got a mini bow too except for hers is just pink and well a daisy bow so anyway, this is my part on Daisy. So anyway, overall, I think she's pretty cute. Well, they're all cute. Yeah, but I think she was, like, well-designed at that. She's pretty cute. Anyway, let's go to my next sum sum. Now, I'm reviewing Chip. You know, like, Chip and Dale and that. Um, I thought you guys would notice them anyway. But yeah, so this one is Chip, guys. So the one with the black nose is Chip. And it's Chip's ears are like so tiny, like if I zoom out here, it's like so tiny, but like cute. His winky eye makes him look so adorable. He has like a little stripe down his back, which is pretty cool. A little like tail. And he's like quite a simple kind of one, but he's also a bit complicated, I guess. But uh, yeah, overall he's pretty cute, guys. And I like him too. But guys, if you want to know where to get the winky eye ones from, because I'll also be reviewing the winky eye piglet today as well. Well, I got mine from um, New York. Um, but, um, yeah, so you basically can get it from America or anywhere elsewhere. But you definitely can't get it in the UK, guys. So if you're a UK person, you will not be able to order these online. Just pointing out. And they probably won't be in the Disney store either. So if you want a winky eye one, go to New York. Or just go on online on the American store. Or just look for them in Disneyland. They might have them. I don't know. When I went, to, they didn't. Anyway, so that's Chip. And let's go to the next one. Next, I have Scrump, who is from Lilo and Stitch. If you guys didn't know, it's like Lilo's voodoo doll thing. I like her hair. It's kind of crazy. She's got a tiny little bow, which is adorable. And the thing I like most about her is her face. They've actually changed it a lot. Because on most of the Sims, as you can see over here, do you have like dots? But you see here they went, whoa, freestyle. <coughs> so they actually made the eyes look like buttons, which is pretty cool. And they like stitched all across the mouth and that. So it's really detailed effects, which is what I love about her. Best of her is so simple. 
Anyway, guys, guy shows like a green hat and some green feet and etc, etc. And is this like a red bow or something? Is it meant to be like a red ribbon around her? I don't know. <laughs> I haven't seen any in Stitch in a while. So, anyway, this is Scrump and Scrump. Yeah, it's done. Let's go into the next one. Now I'm reviewing Donald. <coughs> well, I've already reviewed Daisy. And technically I've already reviewed Donald because I reviewed it like three episodes ago when I was with Mr. Monkey. So if you guys want to feel my whole detailed kind of explanation about Donald, I'll go there. But as a little quick kind of um, run through, um, I like his hacks. It's just so cool. And his beak and his... Um, his bow, it look, it's so cute and yeah he has like little blush cheeks as well like Daisy so anyway, yeah, Donald is really cool they like, they are definitely made to be <laughs> with each other like I've got Daisy here actually Oh, so cute <laughs> anyway let's go into my next one now I'm reviewing Winky Eye Piglet so she's a lot like Chip where she has like the winky eye and that but her ears are like kind of floppy, but that kind of makes it look quite cute. And I love the detail on the back. Look at that, it's so cool. She has little pink feet, and yeah, her face is just adorable. Look at her little nose. Her eyebrows are kind of moved as well. But like I said, for Chip, you can only get her in like countries other than the UK, basically, for now anyway. So if you live in China, America, etc., you will be able to get these winky eyed ones. But if you're in the UK, I don't think you will for quite a while. Um, anyway, yeah. So, Piglet, you are now reviewed. Tick. Let's go on to the next. Now I'm reviewing this duck, which I think they named it the Ugly Duckling, but it's from Lido and Stitch. It has a little tear in its eye, that side, yep. Um, yeah, so this one's pretty detailed. It has the wings, it has a little floppy little tiny hair, really tiny hair, and it has a little furry tail, and yeah. So it kind of reminds you of Donald and Daisy, except for the beak is like really low. Uh, yeah, so cute, really cute duckling. Yeah, but at first I was actually kind of confused of what this was, but then I remembered, oh, it's a story now that Lilo told Stitch and that. Um, and that, I think that was kind of a spoiler there, if you have never seen any of Stitch in, the, in like the whole world. But you probably have seen it. So hopefully it's not a spoiler. But anyway, yes, this is Ugly Duckling. And overall, he's like really, really cute. We've got a little teeny eye. It's just adorable. Let's go on to the next one. Okay, that guys. And now I have Ursula, who is my next Simpsons, which I'm reviewing. I have all the little mermaid Simpsons. I've actually only got her. Because I'm in the UK, I looked on the Disney Store UK online. And as soon as the little mermaid ones came out, they went like every single one on the website went out. They were like clean. And then new ones have come in since. So I went to Disneyland not very long ago. And I found Ursula there, but no others, unfortunately. From Little Mermaid. So anyway, let's, yeah, let's go into more of a view of her. So I love her hair. It's like all fuzzy and it's like adorable. I like how they've like put like the little like blue eyelids is on her. And it's got a little circle nose, it's just adorable. And this is like her tentacle and everything. I think my favourite part of her is the hair. But the weirdest and cool part of her is her legs. Look, she literally has eight of these. Eight of these some some legs. Whoops, she kind of like fell just then. Yes, yeah, so anyway, uh, Merce is really cute and adorable. Yeah, how can they make villains look cute? It's crazy. And she's actually my first Disney villain as a Simpson. So, yeah, you're good. You're good as a, good as a Simpson. Bad, bad, bad. Bad as everything else. Bad, evil. Anyway, let's go to the next one. Now, also, when I went to Disney, I also got some Aladdin Simpsons. So I'll show you my other two Aladdin ones after this one. So, I only have three, unfortunately, but I do want all of them, but I can only really get three at that time, because they only had, like, three there. Anyway, so, I've got Sultan here, who is Jasmine's father, who guys didn't know. Um, so, he's got, like, a really cool hat in that, which is adorable. My favourite part about him, as soon as I saw him on the shelf, I was like, I'm getting him because of his beard. Look at his awesome beard, it's, like, all fuzzy, it has a moustache and everything, it's crazy. But then I wondered after that, I was like, why does he have brown... Brown, I think it's called, why did I just forget now? Brown, eyelashes, no it's not eyelashes, he always have eyelashes, duh. these things, these things here, eyebrows, there you go, 
remembered it off the top of my head. So yeah, why is his eyebrows brown? Maybe Nusa have brown hair. Possibility. Anyway, I love the detail on his face. This is amazing. I love the detail in his back as well. Like his, look all the zigzags. These little gold shoes and everything. This is so cute. So I love this guy. So yeah, let's go to the next one. Now this is Jasmine. She's actually my favourite out of all of the Aladdin Simpsons. But she's just so cute. I love her hair on the back. It is amazing. Look at all the detail on that. She even has earrings. She has little gold shoes. I thought they were gold. They've put them as blue. Okay. She has like a gold belt. She has little bits in her hair to make her hair look really cool. Like little blue bits. And then she has like a blue band. She's quite cool. She has like a fringe. It's kind of nice. I like her. She's so cool. And she's actually my, not my first princess, she's my first, so we've got Elsa, Anna, Snow White, and her, so she's my fourth Disney Simpson princess. Some some Disney princess, do you? <gasps> anyway, so I really like her, she's so cool, amazing. Let's go into my last Simpson. Okay, my last new Simpson, which I got before, after the last episode, was Aladdin. Um, you, you can't get Jasmine on their own. <laughs> Sorry, you can't. So, yeah, Aladdin's got this really cool hat, which is amazing. He has, like, a crazy fringe. Crazy. But, like, his hair's pretty cool, isn't it? It's kind of nice. I like it. I love the detail on his back. Well, he doesn't have much detail. But he has quite a bit of detail. It's kind of nice. And then he has pink feet and pink hands. The thing I would have liked was, I think they should have brought out another Aladdin one too, but like, the Prince version of him. Because this one's nice and all, but like, if you wanted to make, create the scene with news and some sort of Aladdin and Jasmine on the carpet, you kind of want the other Aladdin too. It's so, like with the Baymax, so you brought two Baymaxes, you can do two Aladdins, right? Right? Anyway, um, that's him done, reviewed. Awesome. Thumbs up. Yeah, so that's my last one. Okay guys, another Simpson for you guys, I just forgot that I had another one, but I do, and it's this massive mini, it's a large mini, and she is so cute, she's fluffy as hell, like so fluffy, so much beans down there, and she's just adorable, her bow's kind of floppy and so it is, but she's amazingly cute, so I definitely advise to get her, whoop, she's so cool, and... Yeah, that's her. Yeah. Oh, but I have one more thing to show you. So, yeah, goodbye, Mini. I have recently been to Disneyland, as you guys can all tell, and I've got the Build Bears 60th Limited Edition Diamond Celebration Bear. And I've named it Diamond, and I got her the whole outfit. And it's super adorable. I love her. I love this bear. Like, look at all the detail and everything. It's just adorable. Anyway, back to back to more reviewing. And okay, all some sums have now been reviewed. Woo! All my new ones have anyway. So I think they're all adorable and just so cute. <laughs> so you guys probably gathered my voice fades a bit and it's, the camera's a bit jerky, but it's kind of hard to talk and hold a camera and focus in. Yeah, it's just hard. Anyway, let's do my part two of this review. But not reviewing these guys. No, I'm reviewing someone else now. Yeah, because I'm reviewing four things I've just realised now. So, that's the first thing. So, bye guys. Whoosh. Now, I'm going to go head over and review Anna and Elsa Frozen. So, I've decided to re review Anna first because she's just adorable. Start with the youngest first. So, I love the detail on her dress and everything. That's just amazing. So pretty. It's all like glittery here too. It's so cool. And I've actually t I've actually taken off this bit and everything. Like, if you take off this bit, which I'm not going to do now because it's kind of fiddly. It looks so, so cool like without it as well. So, her dress is just amazing. Amazing. I love all the patterns and everything. About it. Now, let's head over to her wrist here. She has this awesome Frozen Fever bracelet, the one that Elsa gave her in the short movie. And yeah, it's really cool. 
comes off now and again because it doesn't have the string on it anymore but yeah it's really cool now she's very poseable like you can pose in like everything she's moving wrists and everything which is kind of handy I decided to go for the Disney store and also as the ones you get elsewhere like they kind of look a bit weird I thought these ones looked the nice ones so if the back of her head and um, I don't know how to still like some of that sunflower clip and her face and all looks really cool um, it's, she's got this really, it's like really nice ginger in that and like she has all the freckles and everything and her bun's like really pretty, it's not like the one where you have it like and it goes like up there or whatever it's like a small pretty bun, I, I like it now underneath she has some shoes and they are these black kind of pumps and they're pretty nice and she has like these tights with them too and yeah so this is my overall view on Anna I think she's amazing and I'll definitely go for the Disney store version of, of her now head over to Elsa <coughs> now Elsa it looks so pretty it's just amazing she has a little flower clip in her hair her hair is all nice and big and bulky but it doesn't have too much gel in which is nice it's kind of flowy you like that you'd like kind of want that in a doll the only thing I do like with this doll is just the skin colour I think it's kind of either too pink or too white or something like that kind of think I want the skin colour, I don't know, a bit different, I don't know. Anyway, so overall, so far so good. Now her dress is lovely and detailed, it's an amazing dress too, look at the back. So much detail, so much everything. Like Anna, she is very poseable, moving wrists and everything. <laughs> kind of hard to stand her up though. Well, I mean like, you have that every doll to be honest. So yeah, she has movable wrists she, um, she also has shoes too she has these um, ice shoes and they look pretty nice I had to keep the band on though because the shoes kind of come off when you take the band off so I just put it back on again so guys don't take the band off the shoes gladly take off everything else though Anyway, so, Elsa, you're good. So definitely go for Disney Store Elsa too. So it's like have these two back together again. Ba ba bum. So that's my second part of this video done. Let's go on to the third and fourth, which are the Funko Pops and the Shock. Now I am on part three of this video, and I am reviewing Joy from Inside Out as a Funko Pop. Now, she has these really awesome black eyes, which are like massive and make her look ten times cuter. Her hair is like really like big and flowy, like her, her whole head is massive. That's because, well, they are Simpsons. It's like a every time thing, which makes them Funko Pops. Why did I say Simpsons? Funko Pops are meant when I said Simpsons. So, her... Uh, dress is still detailed even though it's like so small and skin colour is actually quite a nice colour I wouldn't like it being bright yellow it's kind of like subtle yellow her head can move but nothing else really moving head so yeah overall Joy you're so cute so glad they got the Joy one but I went to the store and they had so many Funko Pops I could not choose but I'm glad I went for the Joy one Anyways, good part four of this video is just the Shopkins, woo! Now, I believe I haven't reviewed my Shopkins for a long time, so I'm not going to review every single one, there's so many of them. We're going to kind of show you each set. So, this is my Fashion Easter set, um, which you can see all these ones in. I think I did do a video on these ones, but I can't remember. I also got a Fashion Easter 2, which have all these Shopkins in. I love this set, it has like a ring and everything, it's so pretty. Let's kind of zoom this camera in a little. So there's like a camera, there's a ring, it's like perfume, there's a hat, 
There's a purse and there are some shoes and a dress. Now I do not remember the names for all these Shopkins. Because I do not have the card with me. But I believe these are, this one's called Hide, this one's called Heels. I remember them ones. Is that one just called Camera? I have no idea. Beaver Way, the set's pretty nice, I like it. Definitely worth getting guys, both two sets. So, we've now got all these ones. I've got like loads of mystery packs since last video. And I've just got so many, I can't review all these. But you can see all the ones I have. Got a few. And some of these are the ones from last video too. But I've got some new ones like the candy apple and the blackberries and stuff like that. They're all so cute. Anyway, these are all my rares and ultra rares and all that kind of stuff. I've got an Oreo one and a pencil one and a diary one. They are so cool. I love them. Like so much. They're my favourite ones. And I've also got Tomato one as well, which is also my favourite one. I've got the shoe, which is pretty rare. I think it's like ultra rare or something. And I've got two rares here. Mr. Taco Guy and this girl. Anyway, so that's my overall kind of review on these. There wasn't really much of a review, it was more of like show you what I have. But yeah, yeah, you can't review all these. You can't, there's too many of them. But they're just so cute. Almost like a pyramid kind of thing. Okay, I'll do for Paramix. Anyway, hope you enjoyed today's video going over like everything. And I'll see you all in another video on my channel very soon. I'm sorry I had slightly, I have to like skip two weeks of videos, but I'm back. And enjoy my channel, guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe and see you all soon. Now let's get, let's get a joy. One second. Bye. Oh, bye. Oh, bye. You, not me. <laughs> bye. Bye. Jinx. <laughs> Goodbye, guys. Bob! Don't wish one I'm killing now. I'm picking up both. There you go. Got one of them. Go. There you go. It's more like it.